You know, as a survivor, people will ask me all the time, how do you stay so positive? And staying positive and optimistic is not a gift that we're born with. Some of us get it all on our own. It's not automatic like smell or sight or touch. It's day by day. I can tell you from the time I was born up until this morning, I have fallen down. And there have been times in my life when people have told me, you know what, you ain't gonna get back up. I don't care what you do. And if I get knocked down again, I'm gonna get up again. Until my last day. You know, I share my story about breast cancer in 2013. Um, I talk about brain cancer in 2016. And people say all the time, wow, like you're so positive. And I think to myself, you know, there are days when I have to dig really deep to stay positive. And for everybody that's out there facing challenges, maintaining an optimistic attitude, Sometimes there's that one difference that somebody can make in our life that will help us overcome our challenges. One year ago, I came here not knowing what my future held. And I decided to control and manage my mindset. And when I talk to people about the power of positivity and how our mindset determines really how we're going to react, it determines our happiness, actually. I know initially it sounds so simple, but the fact is, it's not. We gotta start by believing it. We gotta start by acting it. That's where my title comes from, in fact. Mindset matters. If I only got 3% chance, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take your 3%, I'll take your 1%. In fact, I don't even care if you say it's not happening. And I'm going to fight with my mind sight and not my eyesight. That's always my goal. If I can reach just one, then my job is done for today. Going from school to school, it's my honor. It's my privilege. It's not something that I expect them to be thankful for. I'm thankful for them. Mindset matters. No matter what problem you might be facing, you can beat it. You can live beyond if you so choose.